everybody, welcome back to another video. This is Jim and Crystal with Serpentine Dream. Getting ready to do another uh, oh shed clutch here. Ready to show the parents off. This is the male, the lavender albino. And he's literally tiny compared to the female. Um, so, yeah. Have a good peek at him. He produced uh, a lot of my head clutches this year. So I'll go ahead and show the female off real quick. Here's a Limo Blast girl. Look at her in all of her glory. She's almost 3,400 grams again. Almost said pounds. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, she's a monster already. And literally, she just had that clutch of eggs just literally over two months ago, or two months, about a week or so. Uh, she's already back to 3,400 grams. So she's definitely ready to go again. <laughs> Even though it'll be a while before she does. But here she is, and I'll get the uh, babies out. We can go through those real quick, and uh, just hold on just a moment. All right, here we go, guys and gals. Here's all the babies. This was uh, originally it was a baker's dozen, but we did have one egg go bad during incubation. So what we ended up with was three normals, and then I believe we got yeah three pastels. We have the five lemon blasts and one pinstripe, so not too bad from a. Uh, and everything here is 100% head uh, for lavender albino, um, which actually works out pretty good because there's not really much lavender albino um, genes and uh, heads. In fact, I can't really find any heads running around right now. So apparently, I'm one of the few people at the moment hatching some out, which I guess is a good thing. So we'll go ahead and do some sexing here and try to figure out what we ended up with. Definitely a little boy there. So one little normal boy. He'll definitely be up for grabs. A cute little baby. Alright. Check this other normal out. This runner here. See what we got going on. Just a little girl there, so one boy, one girl. She will be up for grabs as well. So these are all 100% head uh, lavender albino. So nothing in here is just a normal. All right, on to normal number three. This one has some really nice blushing and stuff on it as well. Get that on his back. This little blush marks a little bit of flames coming up. Love the pattern on this one. And we'll see what we got going on here. It looks like another little girl. So, another normal little female. She'll be up for grabs. I'm not trying to get into some uh, lavender albino stuff. It'd be a less, uh, less expensive way to get into it with heads. All right, we'll check out the little, little pinstripe here. I'm surprised I only got one from the clutch, a uh, single gene pinstripe. It's pretty surprising. Real calm. Right, we'll see here what we got. This mill keeps trying to escape over here. That's oh, definitely a boy. All right. So, little boy pinstripe. Most likely he'll be up for grabs as well. All right, check out some pastels here. Make cute little baby. We got this one little normal that will not stay in the tub. All right, let's get you sexed. I love the blushing on these beautiful. Lovely. Yeah, looks like a little girl there. So a lovely female pastel. Uh, she will most likely be up for grabs. Right. 
Okay, I took a quick pause there. I had to put one of the little boys up. He would not quit trying to get out of that tub. But uh, here's another pastel. Very pretty. Nice blushing on this one as well. I love the blushing and the dark. Just, they look awesome. Like I said, everything here is 100% pet for uh, lavender albino. So, we'll see what you are. See so if you want to poop on me too. And another boy. So, beautiful uh, pastel boy. Last one was a girl, so there you go. Get you a pair of them. This will also be available. Another gorgeous pastel. Same great highlights and flames. A little blushed out head. Let's see how we got three bellies. Very gorgeous. Let's see what we're see what we're working with here. It's like no, I don't want none of that. And that's a boy for sure. Ready to go to the bathroom on me too. All right, so another boy pastel up for grabs. So get it while it's hot. All right, now for the uh, for the for the lemon blast. Look at these gorgeous babies. Some of them have full stripes. There's a couple of them look like they had a full stripe. Some have really, really wild broken patterns. So, we'll see what we got going on here. Check out our first one. I was real happy that we ended up with five of them. Uh, can't complain on this clutch at all for the odds. Yeah, looks like that's a little boy there. So, first little lemon blast, 100% head for lavender albino. And it's a male. Now, obviously, I'll be holding on to a few of these. Uh, but a few of these will also be up for grabs. Um, so definitely message me if, you, uh, if you're interested. I've already had one person uh, during the egg cutting already hit me up. So one might already be gone. And we'll get on to the next one. This is one with a really, really busy pattern. Well, it's just really wild looking. All right, let's see what you are. They're not red. Oh. weren't red, they did have some little protrusions, they were clear, so a lot of times that's a sign of a female, could be a boy, I'll have to check that one again later. Like I said, I'll end up keeping a couple of these, and a couple will definitely uh, I'll have to let go, because I really don't need to hold all of them. Alright, another one here with a Awesome pattern. A couple little breaks in the stripe, but mostly full stripe. Gorgeous baby. It'll be real gorgeous when I put some lavender albino with it. Definitely a female there. All right, definitely got a girl going on. I said a couple of them I'll definitely be keeping, a couple I'll definitely be letting go. So each one I'm just a little bit different, a little bit unique. So all right, on to the next one here. Another gorgeous little baby. 
this is one I'm going to try pretty much, yeah, stripe goes all the way through on this one. There's a little bit of pattern that connects right up to it, but it still continues. So really, really, really wild looking. All right, let's check you out. Like, no. Looks like might be another girl here. Yep, another female. All right. Another little girl. So it looks like we're a couple boys and a couple girls on these so far. Gorgeous looking baby. All right, and our last and final little hatchling here. This is another one that has a, uh, just a couple small breaks, but besides that, the, the stripe goes all the way. Not sure which I like more, the full stripe or the broken up ones, because the really broken up ones, the real busy pattern ones are really neat looking. All right, let's check you out and see what we got. Okay, you want to go that way? That's fine. Is a runner. No, calm down. I'll let you go in a minute. And it looks like another girl. So, looks like I got uh, two males and three females. So, I'll definitely at least keep a uh, pair, if not a trio. I'll definitely at least let two go. Possibly three. But uh, definitely hit me up if anyone's interested in any of these. I can work out some kind of deal with you, I'm sure. Like I said, most of this collection will be available. Um, I'm keeping three at max um, just for the project I'm working on. And please uh, comment, like, and subscri uh, subscribe. And uh, I'll catch you on the next video. Thanks for watching.